What's up guys? I got another dumb build idea for you here Gosh. and I'm going to try it on Hazard 5. So basically, five. the sharpshooter has the passive that when you do overkill damage you release an explosion. So I'm going to ignore the M1000, go cryo grenades so that my explosions cause even more explosions. And the dual crit will be extremely helpful for that. And eliminate the dreadnoughts. Remember, you're on your own this time. There's no one to carry your body back. So I will take a blue for that. Hopefully I can get some gold early on so I can maybe re-roll into cryo grenades. Definitely gonna need the crit artifact if possible. I think I'm gonna pass on the meta currency on Hazard 5 since you have so little time to mine anything. And I wanna maximize my power in the current run. As I get stuck on that and mine a bit. So I'll take the luck to increase my rarity upgrades. See if I can pull the elites into the middle of that. I don't think fire rate does that much for grenades, so I will take the huge survivability boost there. And there's cryo grenades. I'm gonna go all in on it to try and get the overclocks as soon as possible there. The scanner just lit up like a Christmas tree. We got a swarm incoming. Let's grab crit there. I wouldn't mind the HP, but I think reload speed is really good on grenades, and I do want the overclocks pretty fast. Hazard 5 gets really difficult really fast. Oh boy, two flyers. Absolutely no mining allowed. I guess reload speed there. Not great upgrade selections. I could re-roll a bit there. The threat level just went up. Grab some crit to go with our passives. Careful, 
They're going blood crazed. Work fast, miner. Alright, so there's a magnet up there a bit, and I will grab the reload speed there. I think the Nitra over there is too risky to go for. That guy's gonna die soon, so I need to be ready for the magnet now. This ain't a picnic, miner. The bugs are all over you. Bring it, Beckers! Let's clear them out! Objective completed, miner. Get to the drop pod before it heads back to orbit. Purple movement speed is some great survivability. Uh, the cryo guard is okay. Deep core can be converted to cold, but I think I'd probably rather just grab that. And I could go either of these. I think I like going into the grenade. Explosion radius or damage reload speed. Those are both great. I think I like the damage reload speed. That's a decent a bit more total stats there. I can get an overclock for that. Probably just the damage stats. I could grab that, but I really want to go hard on the cryo grenades. 20% is, is decent, I suppose. Oh yeah, now we're talking. This one makes me want to be a better dwarf. Ugh, never felt better. Get yourself onto that drop pod. It's about to head out. Stage one completed. Well done. Taking you to stage. So level nine on my main weapon already. That's pretty good. Let's grab some more crit there. I don't think I want to spend that much on one of my non-focused weapons. Reload speed is excellent. I probably will grab that. I don't really have any nitro left over, so I don't want to reroll a ton. These are both pretty good. Luck would have been quite good as well, but not enough to get that as well. So, with two more levels on Cryo Grenade, hopefully I can get the triple explosion. And that should be a huge boost here. Prepare to fight for your life. A big swarm is approaching. Resupply prepared. Clear the landing zone of obstacles. Supply pod launch. Impact Push. imminent. Nice. I suppose probably the Nitra. There could be an instance where you can like tunnel into a wall and that could be pretty good. I'm raring to try this out. Like you create a narrow choke point and then just funnel everything into that and stay still. Oh, 
Sorry, little bud. The sky just lit up like a Christmas tree. We got a swarm incoming. I don't think I care about anything here at this point. I don't want another kinetic weapon because that would open up kinetic upgrades. That would open up construct, which also isn't ideal. Uh, I guess I'll just grab that. That can apply some shock to enemies at least. Yeah, now I'm getting drone upgrades, which isn't ideal. I kind of need to funnel them close together on top of the boss so my shrapnel explosion passive does more damage. Let's grab the reload speed there. And I didn't get the triple grenade, so that's going to be really, really unfortunate. The maximum damage is going to be much lower now. Go the oh, that's the electrical one. These are pretty bad. These are equally as bad. I want it. I can use this. I think I want to take any of those. I guess that's okay. I'll take it. The bugs aren't appreciating your presence, Miner. These are pretty bad. Need it. 
but I'm using a ton of gold on rerolls that aren't doing that much for me. I guess I'll take a little bit of HP here. I really don't like any of these here. I guess Cryo Drone is alright. I don't think I can grab the XP over there. There's so much stuff in the way and it's getting really fast now. I guess probably the HP there. I forgot I don't have the overclocks for the cryo drones yet either. I forgot to check for the symbol there. Crit chance is pretty good. I probably need to re-roll to get some good nitro stuff. Or not. More options. Hell yeah! So 25% radius and it pulls them in. This is gonna change everything. Would have been pretty sick if I had the triple grenade. That's work to be done. Up and at him, miner. When this is done, I'm starting my own bloody mind. That's for damn sure. Show them all it's done. Pretty big radius, at least. Might be better on that one engineer class mod where you can get lots of grenades and then you can get upgrades that are specific to grenades and explosives. I guess the blue for the cryo drones. Crit chance is decent here. Don't really care for any of these. So 89% with the current Nitra. Probably not getting that to 12 on a hazard 5, so may as well go for the crit.
You're cute, but you're dead. can't really go in there and set the detonators off because the freezing effects from the cryo grenades makes it so risky. I guess reload speed for the cryo. Crit is probably maxed out with the current nitro. Well, they're not really moving. Reload speed's all right there. There are too many to count. Get it done, Miner. I just became a better dwarf. I suppose. I suppose the blue there can help you get around the map a bit faster. I don't really have status effect damage, it's just that one thing. Well done, objective completed. Drop pod has arrived. Get there now. It will leave without you. Ooh. Oh, baby. Getting pretty late for XP gain. I think probably reroll here. Crit chance for when my Nitra isn't very high. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Let's shake it up. Sure, why not? Surely next time we'll be better. I don't really care for any of these. Your mission is clear. Get to it. I'm having the best time in my life right now. Your own fault for being full of goodies. Like it is pretty funny when you just tunnel them into one area and they get constantly frozen and can't move. I guess probably just the movement speed at this point. Rare stuff. 
Alright, let's see what happens if I just turtle here for a while. A swarm is heading your way, load up. Die, monsters! Got it right between the eyes! Too much crap in the way, supplies can't land. Clear it out, miner. I never got the crit thing, right? Yeah. That would be a huge boost still. A swarm is heading your way, load up. Yoink! Looks like I'm gonna have to make a huge loop around to get over there. Unlucky, still no double crit artifacts. I guess the... I don't have the base dodge class, so that won't be quite as much value for that one. Probably just more buffs for the cryo grenade at this point. I think crit is probably good for now. Hell yes. Or it will be after I mine a bit of nitro on the last stage anyways. Depends on what I have available here anyways. Yes, please. I want another go. Let me try again. Gonna roll the dice on this one. Yeah, pretty bad options. Too broke. Should have asked for a raise. Power of my kin courses through me. Oh well. This is it. Destroy the cocoons and take out the dreadnought. Could have gone for some slightly safer stuff there.
Well, this is pretty chill, actually. I'm not sure if I have the damage to kill the boss, but this honestly wasn't a terrible run overall, even if I lose here. I think there is some potential there, maybe as the demolitionist class on the engineer. The fire rate reload speed actually would have been decent here, but it wouldn't really help against the Dreadnought. I guess I should get the supply pod ready at this point. Okay, already ready. You're cute, but you're dead. Shoot it in the face! Watch out! It's big and it's dangerous! Yeah, this isn't looking great. I'll do my best. I probably need to bait out another charge and then pull him in, but not when he's frozen. So, he's about half now. Probably gonna get too enraged before I can actually get him low enough though. Oh, I can maybe use some detonators on him? Probably not with the cryo grenade though. That anti synergy guaranteeing my death. Whoa, okay. Chill out there. Oh, that didn't even hit me. We got bugs sign the likes of which I've never seen. I think there was potential there, probably on the demolitionist class mod instead but I didn't quite have the build to kill the boss. If I had gotten the double crit artifact, that probably would have brought it close enough. But just couldn't quite get there in the end, but not bad for uh, Hazard 5, I guess.